If you're looking to get started with the game of Age of Sigma, then we've got a fantastic lesson for you focused on the combat phase. This is part of a series of lessons which is in our Start Playing Age of Sigma course. Now, in our course, we cover absolutely everything from every phase of the game, and also we give you mini games so you can actually put these straight into practice. Now, the one we're going to show you is extremely, well, we felt entertaining, educational, and we really hope you enjoy it. Let us know in the comments. And also, if you want to check out the rest of the series from the shooting phase mini games to the movement phase mini games and all the rest, then check out the link because you'll be able to get that as well as the Start Playing 40k course completely for free as a bonus. So check out the courses and we really hope you enjoy this lesson. Right, Michael, it's time to see who is going to be king of the hill. How does this game work? Right, okay, so for this one, um, we have our spearhead board, okay? Um, this is a 22-inch by 30-inch playing area, um, and we're going to need some objective markers. Now, we do have the board, yep. so we've got them marked on there already. Uh, however, if you don't have a board, then mark out your playing area. You've got one objective in the centre, and then the other objectives you can place uh, three and a half inches in that way, and four and a half inches in from that side. So each of these are three and a half, four and a half. Exactly. But if it's roughly four and five, it, it doesn't really matter too much. No. I mean, you could plan a bigger size table. You could if you wanted. So you can really vary. Don't worry too much about that, okay? So for this one, we're going to be using our custom war scrolls again. Okay. Okay. Um, so we've got a unit of five, a hero, and another unit of five. So we've got two units of ET warriors. Yep. And a VT hero. And a VT hero. All right. And um, what are they armed with, Michael? So we've got some options now. Okay. Mm. So you can pick any of the weapons that we've used in the Colosseum minigame. Okay. okay. Now, if you choose to uh, take the spear, then you also get the javelin from the shooting phase minigames. Okay. And you'll see all of this on the, the War Scrolls. Right. And that'll be in the download for you below. Yeah. So what you're saying is, I can take the hammer. You can take the hammer. Okay. Or I can take a sword. Or you can take a sword. But if I take the spear, I can also throw it in the shooting phase? Yes. Does it come back to me, though? Well, you've got, like, several. Okay. Yeah, or you, if, however you want to imagine it, maybe it comes back to you. Oh, nice. That'd be cool. Like, yes. it just sort of comes back to the hand? Yes. That's pretty cool. But if I take the hammer or the sword, I don't get any ranged weapons? That's right. Okay. Interesting. So you've got some options there. And that obviously represents them using the javelin in combat. Okay. Now, the hero, mm -hmm. so you'll see on their data sheet... Um, so you can, again, choose any of the three weapons, um, but you'll notice that it has a different number of attacks. So the hammer on these guys will only have three attacks. Yeah. The other two weapons will have four attacks each. Okay, so the okay. hammer's more powerful, but less attacks. Yes, and once again, if you choose the spear option, you'll get access to the blunderbuss. Okay, but if you choose the other options, you do not get a blunderbuss. Right, okay, cool. Okay. So if you have shooting, you've got uh, a slightly less effective weapon. Yep. Um, if you don't have shooting, you've got the better weapons. All right. Okay. Cool. All Sounds right. good. So the mission in this one, of course, we have the normal attacker defender and the person who dropped the first unit, the, their army first gets to pick who's going first. Okay. On the table. Okay. So at the end of each player's turn, the active player is going to get one victory point if they hold an objective wholly within their territory. And our territories will be divided long ways. So basically halfway down here. This is my territory. That's your territory. This is mine. Okay. Okay. So you get one victory point for holding an objective in your territory. So if I hold this one mm -hmm. and I hold this one, mm -hmm. two points. Ah, oh, so it's one for each. One for each objective. Yes. Okay. You get two victory points if you hold the objective in the center of the board. So two for this one. Mm -hmm. And you get three victory points if you hold an objective wholly in enemy territory. Right. So these are worth one. This is worth two. This is worth three for me. Yes. Cool, all right. Cool, and then at the end of four battle rounds, the player with the most points wins. All right then, let's do it. All right, so let's roll attacker defender. I've got a three. Okay, well I will do the first drop because that means I can pick who's going first. What weapons are you taking? So I'm gonna take one unit of javelins. Okay. Okay, uh, and I'm gonna take one unit of, I think swords. I'm gonna go for consistency over damage, Right. actually. And then my champion, I will take a hammer because it's cool. And they've got the staff. It's the same model. So we're going to go for that. Okay, cool. Well, my guys have got hammers. Mm -hmm. So I think it makes sense. Fair enough. To go for hammers here. Um, I'm also going to go for hammers here as well. Okay, he's gone, he's gone the hammer. I mean, you are the hammers of Sigma. Yes. Um, but I actually think on my character, I'm going to take the spear and the blunderbuss. Okay. 
Because I remember be, that being pretty effective, yeah, actually. It's pretty good. Yeah. It's pretty good. Okay. All right. Now, one quick mission parameter to mention as well. So there is another way to score points, okay, unique to this mission. Uh, and you're actually going to get two additional victory points if you can slay the enemy hero. Okay. Okay, so they're obviously very good, but if you lose them, you're giving your opponents points. Right, okay. So the unit that has the banner in it, this is going to be my sword unit. But they don't actually have a standard... For they the don't game. actually have a standard for the game. There's no okay. standard bearer keywords. No champion There's keywords. no champion keywords. Got very it. basic. So I'm going to get my um, javelins, and I'm going to put them nine inches away from your territory mm -hmm. on this objective marker. So it's basically with engagement range of our own table. Edge. Exactly. And of course, that means that that objective marker will be mine until you take it off me. Right, I'll put my character down over here then. Very good. Um, I'll get my sword unit uh, nine inches away. Oh, it's a difficult one, isn't it? Do you defend your territory or do you go for the enemy's territory? I oh, know. It is tough. Mm. Now, you can still sprout wings. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. so you can still sprout wings in this one. Same abilities as before. Uh, yeah, we're going to go with that. We're going for a balanced approach. A balanced approach. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Oh, hammers. Such a swingy weapon. Could be so devastating. Yeah, I know. Um, and I will place my hero here, I think. Cool. We'll go with that. Oh, he's going, he's going heavy on the one side there. Mm. Oh, very interesting. See what happens. <laughs> I don't have any tactics with this. Okay. Let's just see what I can do. So I will take the second turn. You can go first, Mr. Box. All right. I like it. Cool. Mm, just outside. Okay, cool. So, uh, how far do you go when you sprout wings? Uh, so it's uh, you add six when you do the run ability, essentially. So eleven inches. So eleven inches. Yeah, I'm out there. Um, and what's the range of my blunderbuss? Is it twelve? It's twelve. Yes. So I'm eighteen away. Mm -hmm. Well, within eighteen. So if I move six, I can shoot you. Oh no, I can move five. You can only move five, yes. Right. Yes. So and you should be just out of 18 because we're nine inches. So I can't seven. shoot you there then. Okay. I'm within six of that. So I'm just going to sprout wings here. Okay. Um, and first of all, I'm going to roll the advance on this unit here. Okay. A two. So they are doing a run ability. They're going seven inches. Yeah. Hmm, I don't like this, actually. I don't like the fact that you maybe go first. Hmm. Throwing a spanner in the works. Well, I'm worried you're going to throw a spear at me. I am going to throw more than spanners at you, that's for sure. That's what I'm concerned about, mm. is the volume of spearage. This unit's going to sprout wings. Okay. Oh, okay. We're going to get each other's backs. Mm. Okay, nice, nice. Now, remember, of course, the heroes are control five. So they're quite good at holding objectives. Mm. Um, now, I have given you some dice, Stephen, actually, for you to mark that those objectives are yours at the start of the game. Okay, cool. So I've got some little Skaven ones here. You've got little comments. All right. Okay, cool. All right, that's me. Okay. All right. Yes, yeah, my turn. So I'll score one, two, three, four. Fantastic. So four points for Stephen. Mm -hmm. uh, over to me, then. So your control is one, yes? Yes. Okay, so all I have to do is get a couple of models on there. I actually might go for your character. What? So I'm going to move five. I'm going to chance a really long charge. Yep, nice. Uh, so we're going to move five there. Mm -hmm. um, you know what, this guy's a baller. He's going to go for a charge as well. Okay. And he's control five, so he should be able to hold this. Yep. And then these are going to... Oh, I'm worried about you coming for this objective. Mm, so you should be. I'm going to move five this way and do some shooting. All right. Okay, so shooting time. Yeah. Just my javelins. Yep. Uh, so we've got ten shots. <laughs> so ten. <tense. laughs> We're hitting on threes. Okay, cool. And then crit does auto wound with javelins. So one auto wound, yep. Uh, and then fours to wound. Uh, we have three total. It's rend one and one damage. Okay, one dead. Okay, cool. All right, and that was this. Oh. Uh, Oh, well, you didn't declare I, it, Michael. I didn't declare it, so... Um, oh, Michael, what are you going to do? Yeah, so I, I was... What, what is the fair thing to do in this The instance? fairest thing to do is to let you choose. 
Okay. Because if I choose this unit, I might be wanting to try and take the objective. At the same time, yeah. you could remove the closest model, yeah. and then my charge is longer. Yeah. So it's better for me to just let you choose, yeah. because that's to your benefit rather than mine. Okay, well you did also point to this unit as well. Yeah. So I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, and I'll actually remove this model to make your charge harder, because this still is under mine. It is indeed, yes. Okay, cool. So okay. That's what I'm going to go for. Hmm. Well, that's my shooting. Mm -hmm. Let's do some charges. So these clan rats yeah. will charge. That's a six, which is not going to make it because I can't end the move within half an inch of an enemy unit. No. The Gracier will also charge. Yeah. That's a six as well. Fun enough. Oh, Michael. You might have made it into your guy. You, you yeah. might have, yeah. But I actually think he's still short. Yeah. Either way, we don't get to move. The Javelins. You're going to chance it? I'm not going to charge with them, I don't think. Okay. Um, hmm. Yeah. You know, we'll roll it because I don't have to. Don't have to use it. Have to use it. We roll something big. Absolutely not. No. Okay. So I'm only gonna get one, two points. Yes. So, so four, two to you. We're we'll in the game there. That sounds really good time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. So new battle round. Oh yeah. Oh no. I might not get a go. <laughs> Five. Five. Two. Oh, thank okay. goodness. Would you like to take next turn? Yes. Fantastic. 100% I would. So another uh, concept that's worth introducing is the idea of an underdog. Okay. Um, so uh, the underdog's determined at the start of battle rounds. It's the player with the least number of points. So that'd be you. That would be me. Uh, in many missions in Age of Sigmar, you may find there's a benefit for the underdog. In this one, there isn't. Okay, cool. We're not using that sort of level of complexity, but sometimes it could be extra command points yeah. or little sort of mission yes. abilities. We'll, we'll talk right? about command points later as well. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's all coming up. Okay, cool. Right. So I need to move... Uh, okay, I mean, if I don't even move, I still mm. score another four points. You do, you do indeed. That's kind of yeah. good. Yeah, but, but you could do some damage. I could do some damage, which I think I kind of want to do some damage. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to move. So I'm over here within 12 inches of this unit, but no closer. Okay. All right. So I just make myself just within 12 there so I can use my blunderbuss, mm -hmm. and he's kind of just protecting my objective over there. This unit is going to move five inches forward here. Now, I need to make sure you don't just jump over me. Mm, I could Stim sprout wings, yeah. It's sprout wings and just take my objective, which yeah. is um, what I'm a bit worried about. Um, so let's go five inches this way. Oh, he's ganging up on me. Yeah, I think it's worth it. Wow. Unbelievable. Right, so shooting phase. Yes. I'm going to shoot my blunderbuss at your unit of uh, clan rats. Okay. So, Michael, two shots, hitting on threes. One hit. Okay. And does wound. Okay. Um, so, it is actually crit two hits, the blunderbuss. Oh, okay. So, you will get another roll to wound. No, just no, one wound. So, minus one, I save. No. Your blunderbuss bounces off my armor. No. Okay, charge phase. Yes. So then, this unit of Liberators. Mm -hmm. I've had to put two units, because obviously in our previous game, well. <laughs> I rolled double ones. They're, they're nine. Excellent. They're in. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, could be in trouble here. So we've got lots of models in there. And then the other unit are going to make a charge roll of a ten. Very nice. Where would you like to go? No, I don't actually want to go that way. Because mm -hmm. if you pile in, you could actually... If I, if I move a model here, yeah. Then they're going to come into combat. Mm -hmm. And also, I want to go here to block you from piling in around onto my objective and stealing off me. So in that case, I'm just going to go all in and try and kill this unit. And the other important thing is, of course, that after you pick one unit to fight, I then pick a unit to fight. Yes, yeah, so right. If you charge two different targets, you might get hurt before you actually get to fight. Mm -hmm. Now, I know I'm within 12. Mm -hmm. I'm going to see if I can roll it. Yeah, go on then. Oh, I saw one six. It's not enough. <laughs> okay, cool. So I get to go first. You do indeed. I'm going to go with my big unit of five. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Right, can the hammers shine? Ten attacks, Michael. Looking for fours. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, this is why you don't take hammers. <laughs> I don't know how you've done that, but you have. It's, it's like superb work, Stephen. It's actually like we manufacture this to happen, but we genuinely don't. We've, yeah. <laughs> what is that? Not a single four on ten dice. That's. 
only I could roll dice averagely. <laughs> okay, well, moving on. It's my turn to choose a unit for a fight ability. Obviously, I'm going to pick my invincible... What did, what did they even hit? Like, literally. <laughs> <laughs> You're so sure I've been swinging above your heads. <laughs> or either that, or I thought, he's literally blindfolded, right? <laughs> it's a bold move, Cotton. So, my rats are going to use their fight ability and target the unit that hasn't fought yet. Yeah, go on, then. So, threes to hit. Uh, okay, cool. How? I still can't get over that. That is mental. Force to wound. So you got two wounds there. This is Ren 2 because you charged. Okay, one dead. One slain liberated. Oh god, this is not boded well. Right, so I've only got three dudes left in that unit. <laughs> They've just seen what their friends could do. Yeah. Um, right, now I'm due all hits now. Mm -hmm. That's how it should work, right? No, only two hits. Two hits, okay. Three to wound. Okay, two wounds. Uh, Ren 1. Uh, they both go through though, you do two, kill two models. Oh, that's two slain rats. And you were wondering why I made two charges earlier. Well, I knew. <laughs> yeah. be, uh... Okay, cool. So that concludes the end of my turn. Mm -hmm. There's no more combats. So nope. that means I get one, two, three, mm -hmm. four, five, six, seven. Yes, very nice. This is my Heavily objective. in the lead. Mm. 11 to two points. So my turn then, and I need to get some more of these objectives. So I'm going to send these clan rats, and I'm actually going to go with uh, sprout wings. Mm. We're going to go here. Thought you might. And um, what we're going to do is, obviously, we only need one to take this central objective. Mm -hmm. We're going to leave your Lord Veritant in the wind, um, and I'm going to move with the Grace here, try and get some damage in. Yeah, nice. Uh, I could retreat, but I'd take D3 mortal wounds. Yeah. Um, oh, it is tempting, mind. It is tempting. Yeah. No, no, we'll stay there. We're brave. We are brave. brave I mean, you can't hit for Toffee, so no, uh, we're all good. Um, shooting. Yes. So the javelins don't have shooting combat. So no shooting for you so then. No shooting. All right. So the charges. The Grace here does make it. Why can't you roll a double one? Um, and the Grace is just going to go into these guys. I will go on to the objective. Then. Okay. Cool. So the Grace here is going to hit the Liberators. Three attacks because I've got a hammer. Which unit? The bigger unit or the smaller so unit? This will be the smaller unit. And what I'll, I'll do is try and avoid being within three of your, okay. your bigger got unit. Though so you could pile in and hit me anyway. Yeah. All right. That oh. is three hits with the hammer. Michael, okay. what's going on? And then threes to wound. That is two wounds at rend one. So five ups. Yes. Okay. That's two Liberators slain. This is a problem. This Gracie's hammer is vicious. This is a big problem. Right, now this unit liberates here. Mm hmm. We're going to move that dice out of the way. Let's see if the hammers can hit their target this time. I'm just going to put all of them onto here. Yeah, that makes sense. Right, don't mess this up, lads. <laughs> well, okay. I mean, it's better than last time. I mean, it's not great though, Michael, is it? It's only well... four. Okay, they all wound now. They all wound. Okay, so that. This, I could be in trouble here. I need fives. Oh, great horned rat, you have seen me. Thank you, dark god. <laughs> I don't know what's happening, mate. I swear, no streams. <laughs> no stream has ever gone this way. Um, and yet we are somehow managing to pull the most ridiculous rolls out of the bag. This is meant to be a quick tutorial, Michael. <laughs> Well, joke's on you. The rats are now going to hit the one Liberator that's still alive from the other squad. Uh, oh dear. Uh, two hits and then fours. That is one wound at Rend 1 on that Liberator. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll take it. One so... damage. Oh, sweet rats. Right, my next combat. Yeah. He's going to show his friends how it's done. <laughs> two hits with a hammer. One hit. Okay. One wound. One wound. Don't roll a five. Five up. Okay, oh. one is slain. Fair enough. <laughs> Owe you that much. Um, so at the end of my turn there, yeah. uh, this will now become mine. Yeah. And this will also become mine because I have control five with the grace here. So five, six, seven to your six. I can't believe that. I can't either. Um, but we, we move on. So one, two, three, four. We are currently six to your eleven. And it is priority time. Okay. It's a four. four. Oh, I really, turn. really wanted that one. I bet you did. 
Right, okay, so uh, I'll take the turn. Mm-hmm. Um. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So I'm going to move five inches to here, mm -hmm. and then I will shoot you here okay. with my two shots from my blunderbuss. Right, he's seen his friends do nothing, so one hit. Okay. One wound. A wound, rent one. We are fine. Of course you are. Just we have invincible rats. You literally have invincible models, Michael. Right, <laughs> go he's going to charge. Okay. Uh, ten. Oh, ten. Okay, you might be in. Uh, yeah, within Ooh. ten and a half, I think. Yep, that looks close enough to me. I'm in. Very nice. I'll be there, right, just within yes. half an inch. Okay, cool. So, I get the... Well, I've got the spear. Mm -hmm. Not really the best attack to be charging no. with, but... Do you have four attacks? I do have four attacks. I was hoping just to kill a model, but then I probably wouldn't have made my charge. That's true. There we go. Four attacks. Uh, Three's to hit. Three hits. And four's to wound. Four's to wound. I'm not sure why I've chosen to go with this unit first. It was a bad mistake. Um... One wound. one wound. That is not good. Uh, rend one. I'm okay, of course. Mm. So I have invincible rats. Mm. That was definitely the bad play from me there, actually. Yeah. Mm. I think we are going to pile in this way. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I'm going to hit the big unit. Yeah, I thought you might. Yeah. So can the Grey Seer do it again? I got so. See, what I've got caught up with there is the yeah. classic Warhammer 40,000 yeah. player. <laughs> I've just gone straight, first of all, with a charging unit. And that was a big mistake. You need to stop and think. Do not do a Steve, okay? You hit with all three, haven't you? Yeah. Yes, I have, Steve. That is two wounds oh. again from the race here. So, a couple of fives. A couple of fives is all you need. Oh, I've seen, I've seen you roll too many of them. No, none! Uh, there's two more liberators slain. <laughs> this guy is on fire. Well, he's on something. He's just, yeah. <laughs> right, I'll go with my unit of three. Yep. Who would um, you like to hit? Well, the two remaining rats. Yeah. Right, let's see if I can kill them now. Okay. Like a third time's a charm and all. Yes. Just three hits. Okay, that's okay. half. That's, that's average. Not, that's not bad. That's, that's not what I should have had earlier. Okay, two wounds, Mike. Two wounds. Don't do it. Do not. I can't see it. Oh, oh that is them slain. Whew. They are gone. But the problem is, you've killed just enough mm. to still keep that objective. I have, yes. Like, why can't you just kill one less? Well, like one less hit, Michael. That's what we needed. Not over yet, Stephen. I know you could kill my lord here as well. Kill your lady here. I will pile into it all on the objective. Yeah, you need it. We match the control now. Mm. Okay, so I've gone for consistency yeah. over damage. We're going to see if that pays off. Well, you, to be honest, mate, anything you pick pays off. <laughs> yes, true. Uh, okay, so we hit on threes. Yeah. We do have crit two hits. So that goes back in there. And then we wound on threes as well. Um, and we get three wounds now. A hero is a bit tougher. They've got a three-up save. Don't worry. I still managed to cool. fail most of them. Cool. What's the so health? One damage each. So you've got five health total. Um, so just allocate two to your pool. Two to the pool. All right, cool. Um, and then you're one liberator. Right, I'm going to try and hit your rat. Mm -hmm. How many wounds do you say? Five on a hero. Oh, so I can't even kill you. Sadly not. Especially if I can't hit you. So one hit. Oh, I can't even wound you either. Okay. These rats, what are they made of? <laughs> They make the sterner stuff than I am, clearly. So you get two points. This just, is just bad. The two. Yeah. This has gone terribly wrong, yeah. everybody. Yeah. So uh, now 13 to my seven. Mm. And 13 is a magic number, Stephen. Oh, God. Um, so my turn it is. Um, hmm. Interesting. So if I retreat here, I would take mortal wounds. Yeah. And then you might take the objective. Yeah. At the end of the turn. I don't want that. Um, and over here, I need to stay in combat. So I think we're actually just going to stay where we are. Yeah, I thought you might. Uh, and I'm going to hit first, of course. Yeah. Uh, yeah, with the... I mean, it's too good not to, right? You have to, right? Yeah. So he's going to go for the three. Yeah. He misses. Yes! Finally! Finally, <laughs> Finally a, re a reprieve for the Stormcast. Right, now I'm going to go with my man with the spear. Mm -hmm. Lord Veriton. Only two hits. Okay. Oh, should have just stuck back and done my blunderbuss stuff. One wound, it's not enough. Uh, it's rend not... one. It does kill, uh, it does one damage. Yeah. One damage. I didn't do any early because you made your save. Yes, because we are invincible. This right? was huge. Yes. One more and I could have stole that objective. Yep. Yeah, not enough though. Now you're going to get shanked by some rats. Don't do it. So we've got our swords. Uh, so you do hit on threes. And we get a crit, two hits. Threes again. Uh, three saves, no rend. One more wound goes through. Consistently getting one through. 
Yeah. Right, my three hammers now. Yes. Uh, so I'm going to pile in two here. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I need to stand the... It doesn't matter actually. Yeah, because I'm going to be five control regardless of how many uh, yeah. damage I've got in my pool. So come on boys, you can do this. Oh, it might be oh, hammer time. Oh, it's hammer time. It might be hammer time. They just have to warm them up, Michael. Yeah. Okay, that's four wounds, four please. Four wounds. Oh, dear. So I need to pass two of these. I do have a three-up save. So fours to live. Yes! The big rat's dead. Take that. Crazy, it goes down. See ya. Big moment. A big moment. Okay, fantastic. Well, at the end of my turn, then, mm. um, I get... Two for the middle, because mm. nobody's taken it, so it's still mine, and this becomes yours. I think we know where this is going. There's one more turn left, Stephen. Okay. See who goes first. Yes. Six. Yes. One. Come okay. on, Sigmars! Fair enough. Okay, I think it's time to just go all in. Yes, so this obviously is remaining under your control, so you can leave it. Yeah. Um... But if I fall back here, I get D3 mortal wounds, don't I? You do indeed, and you've only got two remaining. Yeah. So you've got three in the pool. Can't use the old leapfrog manoeuvre either. No. The old sprout wings. Is that allocated to me somewhere? That is this one model that's on their own. Okay, cool. Yeah. So, uh, charge phase. Mm -hmm. This guy here is going to charge. Yep. Draw a seven. In they go. And then the big unit. Seven as well. Fantastic. Okay, cool. Can the rats continue to be invincible? I hope not. So we're going to go with the big hammer unit. Yep. Uh, it's three of them. Yes. Here we go. Whew. Oh dear. Only two hits. Two hits. Okay. Sometimes that's enough with a hammer though. One wound. <laughs> One wound. Five up save. <sighs> One Does dead. Go through. So um, there's three in the pool. I'll take two out to yep. kill a rat. Mm -hmm. And then now there's just the one in the pool. Now, who are you going to go next with? Uh, well, uh, the only unit I've got left. Um, I mean, I... sorry, who are you going to attack? <laughs> I'm going to attack. Oh, I might split my attacks. I'll take my chances because then I'm more likely to live. So I'm going to put one guy onto your one wound liberator. Okay. And three onto your Lord Veriton. Yeah, nice. We're going for it. We're gambling. That's the Skaven yeah. way. Yeah. So well, onto your. paid off for you so far. Yeah. <laughs> Of to your liberator. Yeah. Threes. We've got one hit. That's all we need. That's all we need. Threes. That is a wound. You've got a four up save. Damn. Yes, liberator. Damn. And then into the uh, your hero, uh, we do have five hits. Oh dear. You mean my hero that's not killed a single model? Yeah. Oh, no, there's a bit of a whiff there. So just two wounds on the hero. It is I'm enough, though. I'm sure I'll roll a one and a two. Oh, so we're close. Two. We're close. Very close but not close enough, Michael. Okay. There you go. So over to your two units. My Liberator next. One hit. Mm-hmm. One wound. Okay, so five up. I do save it. Of course, the invincible rat strike again. <laughs> now the ridiculously rubbish Lord Verviton. Yep, it's on form. <laughs> <laughs> yep, cool. <laughs> Good. Good chat, everybody. But <laughs> the most important thing is who controls objectives, and, and that will be mine. A million points at this stage. Okay. Um, so you're, what, 13, 16, 17, 18, 20 points to you. And I killed your lord. 22 points to you. Yeah. So over to my final turn, then. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to go for spite. Uh, I will split again, because it's funny. Yeah. Uh, so I'll do three into your lord, Veriton, and then one into your... It's worth two points, right? It's worth two points. Mm -hmm. See if you um, can kill it. So into your one... One guy, one hit. One hit. One wound. I'm fine. This Lives. liberator, I don't know what he's made of, but his friends were made of different <laughs> stuff. Yeah. And then into your character, they all hit. Oh dear, it's time for... And then... Five saves. It's three no ends. So all threes. Oh! Fair enough. There we go. Uh, there we go. That was the misses. That yeah. was the counter from all the misses earlier. Well, the Stormcast win, 22 to uh, 11. Uh, and uh, yeah, thank you for the game. Michael, Steve. that was fantastic. That was really good fun. And we really hope you enjoyed watching this as well and got something from this. So give this game a go um, and let us know in the Discord if your game was as crazy as ours was. Um, but anyway, thank you so much. I think we've covered a lot there. We certainly have. Um, but we, look, we're only scratching the surface with our rats. Um, and uh, we'll see you on the next lesson.